Welcome back to the show happening this weekend. You are invited to explore a world of unique handiworks and crafts and more than 70 artists, makers and creators. Today we welcome to Good Morning in Michigan, Brandon Strong, founder of the Great Lakes Market to talk more about the market at Uptown Bay City coming up soon. Good morning to you. Good morning. This is exciting. You know, uh, tell us first off a little bit about uh, the Great Lakes Market. What y'all about? Yeah, so this will be our eighth annual market at Uptown in Bay City and we'll be showcasing over 70 artists, makers and creatives. Yeah, what inspired this in, in the first place? You know, why is this needed? There's a lot of local talent that usually gets overshadowed. Um, we have a lot of artists that are really, <laughs> they're fun, they're quality, they're, yeah. Dedicated to their craft. So kind of, we're looking at some photos here. This gives us an idea, kind of set the scene uh, for us. I mean, again, rows and, and rows. What will people find here? A little bit of everything? Yeah, you'll find anything from candles to apparel, jewelry, art, um, mums, a little mix of everything. Okay, getting into the fall spirit. Uh, and what do you think this means, though, for these local artists to be able to showcase, you know, what they make and do? Yeah, a lot of these people, this is their livelihood. So this is how they make their money and how they put food on their table. So they appreciate any sale that they can get. Well, and again, what, what inspired you here? You know, what's your, your background? Are you a creative yourself? Uh, I am a creative. I also own a flower shop. Um, but I've always been supportive of the arts, and this is the one way I found that I could support local artists. That's wonderful. And again, this weekend you'll be at Uptown uh, Bay City. How is this a great location for this event? Yeah, it's a great setting. Uh, we're all on the grass, so it's easy walking, easy parking. Uh, there's also plenty to eat and drink and enjoy at Uptown. And how do you track down these uh, vendors? How do they get involved with this? The best way is word of mouth, um, but we have all of our information on our website also. That's wonderful. And uh, what's the feedback that you've gotten? You said you've been doing this for eight years now. Uh, this is really a chance to find unique things. Yeah, uh, we've come a long way. The very first year that we did this, we had 18 oh, wow. artists. So now we're a little over 70. So progress takes time. Yeah. So, <laughs> hey, you got your uh, plenty of choices there. And then what do you think this means? Uh, not only, you know, you talked about this for the artists, but just the community as a whole. Why is this such a great community event? Uh, first of all, it's free and it's family friendly. Um, we have live music also. So it's just a nice time to kick off autumn. Yes, so. of course. And then uh, bottom line, why is it so important to you as a small business owner to support other small business? Uh, because we're all in this together. <laughs> yeah. Um, one day at a time for sure. Yeah, one day at a time. Uh, the market at uh, Uptown Bay City taking place September 6th and 7th, as you heard there, free to get in. There's so much going on there, more than 70 artists and makers. He mentioned live music. Uh, you can shop and eat as well. So again, take advantage of the free admission and parking. And I guess it's never too early to maybe start some Christmas shopping. I don't know. Just we actually somebody. have a lot of people that will admit that this is their start of their Christmas shopping. So it's yeah. never too early. Yeah, you got to plan ahead. Well, thanks so much for coming in and, uh, you know, it should be a great event. Will be.